My name is Dr. Yaba Blay, and I am here with my partner, Noel Tayard. We are working on a project called One Drop Conversations on Skin Color, Race, and Identity. So to be a part of the project, what we're looking for from contributors of having this experience of having their racial identity questioned, but for they themselves, they are very clear that they are black. My name is Kenya Casey. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky. My parents are black. Their parents are black. It isn't until you go to great grandparents that there's any white blood. So my mom said we were like Heinz 57 sauce. We were just all different shades. My father would say, you know, we're, we don't look like this because he married a white woman or his parents were biracial and chose to marry a white person. It's because of slavery and what happened when the slave master raped or slept with a slave. I don't feel comfortable calling a slave owner a grandparent. So upon meeting you for the first time, mm -hmm. what do people usually assume about your identity? If I wear my hair straight, I know that some people will mistake me for being white. Mm. Or, you know, if I wear my hair curly, then I'm Latina. So what is it about you? Why do you think people look at you and say, oh, she's biracial, she's Latina, she's something else? Beautiful. Good, I look out. It's the hair, it's the nose, it's my features. People want to make certain assumptions and put you in a box because of, you know, how you look physically. Amazing. Most people assume that with light skin mm -hmm. comes privileges. For me, I think it's unfortunate in the black community that we have this divide, a division based on skin tone. You know, growing up and having to defend my blackness, I didn't feel like I was black enough. Middle school was just horrible. My mom switched schools because everybody wanted to fight me. There were a couple of days where I was like, I just can't go to school because I didn't know what was gonna happen. And I remember looking back, I was walking down the hallway and looking back and there were all these girls who were ready to jump me. Now, when you reflect back on that and you think mm -hmm. about those girls, that mm -hmm. hallway full of girls, mm -hmm. any of them look like you? No, they look like you. Are you black enough? Yeah. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.